For what purpose does the gentleman from Florida seek recognition? Mr. Speaker, I uh, ask unanimous consent to speak out of order for one minute. Without objection. Mr. Speaker and my colleagues, I rise tonight to pay tribute to six United States Marines who lost their lives May 12, 2015. They died not in combat, but in a mission of mercy, aiding the people of Nepal, who, as we've read, have been devastated by a horrific and deadly earthquake. I would like to, at this time, yield to their member of Congress to, rec to recognize each of the Marines who sacrificed their, their life. First, uh, Congressman Mike Pompeo of Kansas. Captain Christopher Lee Norgren, Wichita, Kansas, Kansas 4th Congressional District. Congre Congressman Adrian Smith of Nebraska. Captain Dustin Lukasevich, Alma, Nebraska, Nebraska's 3rd Congressional District. Congressman Ken Calvert of California. Sergeant Eric Matthew Seaman, United States Marine Corps, Marietta, California, California's 42nd Congressional District. Congressman Bill Foster of Illinois. Corporal Sarah Abigail Medina, Aurora, Illinois, Illinois 11th Congressional District. And Congressman Trent Franks uh, from Arizona. Lance Corporal Jacob Andrew Hug. Phoenix, Arizona, Arizona's 8th Congressional District. Mr. Speaker and my colleagues, greater love hath no man than to lay down his life for his fellow man. We, the members who represent those brave Marines, and I'll read my brave Marine from my district, Sergeant Ward Mark Johnson the of Altamont Springs, Florida, Florida's 7th Congressional District. But we all ask you to join us in a moment of silence. And we also ask that as we approach this Memorial Day, that we remember in our thoughts and in our prayers all those brave Americans and their families who have paid the ultimate price in service to our nation. Mr. Speaker.